Hey, what's up? Uh, my name is Brian Walmer. You might know me as BW1979 on the new Saturday morning, uh, Sonic set, Saturday morning Sonic forms. Uh, first of all, I want to say that this is the, to um, the person in charge, Stefan, uh, that what you're doing is a is a great job. I think it's Stefan. I could be wrong. Or sports? <laughs> I don't know what the name is. Uh, porpoise. Let's just say the porpoise. Uh, the what you have done is a great is a great thing. I mean, there's a lot of Sonic uh, sites out there that are dedicated to Sadam. Some are just you know dedicated to not just Sadam, but to Sonic X and Sonic Underground Adventures of Sonic the Hedgehog, as well as the comic book. But you've come out and you've put a, a, a you know a, a site that's totally dedicated to it. I mean, you got information on here uh, that we have heard of, and you got. But also, you've added a little bit more detail uh, to what we have heard, and you know, really didn't know that much about. I mean, I mean, when you know, when you told it, when you mentioned the fact that Ben Hurst told you, or you found out from someone that Ben Hurst, you know, told you, you know, added more detail to what the to the what the lost third season of Sad M was going to be like. You know that totally amazed me. I mean, I, I, I met you know I thought I knew what it was going to be like, but I, I was totally wrong. Uh, I mean, the ideas. I mean, and, and you got to admit that some of the ideas uh, from that very show made their way into the um, comic book. Uh, I mean, Sally. Let's take for example Sally being romanced by somebody else. That made itself made its way into the comic book around the early 20 to 30 issues to basically almost past issue 50 with Jeffrey St. John you know taking the play, you know taking that role of being the other that would romance her um, you take a look at some other ideas like uh, Dulcie coming into her full powers I mean she came into her, her full powers uh, in the comic book you take a look at someone. You take a look at the idea of tales maturing. I think that's already been seen with growing with the early story with the tales uh, three part miniseries as well as the story they preluded, uh, growing pains. Um, and, and you know things like that. And I also think, you know, you know the you know what you have done. You know, is you've allowed fans not just to talk about Sad Am. But to talk about Sonic X and Sonic Underground, now I mentioned earlier there are sites that are dedicated to all three. But you, you know, you have a site that's mainly main for Sad Am. I mean, I know there's fans for United, United for Sad Am, the FUS uh, site that's out there and, and everything. And um, but, you know, I think you know what you have done is really allowed fans to come again and find have another place to talk and not be restricted by anything you know as well um, and I'd like to thank you for allowing me to be a part of that now I do want to send a message out to a lot of the uh, fans out there uh, fellow Sad Am fans you saw some of my videos uh, that I posted on fan content you know some of Sonic Sad Am, some of Sonic X and let me just say that if you think you've seen some good videos you ain't seen nothing yet because long before YouTube, youtube.com uh, banned me from the site and basically you know removed all my videos because of the TMS for kids uh, probation thing or content or whatever they call it I, po I had over I think I, I can't really remember I'm sure I had way over 700 videos, maybe 100. I can't, I can't really remember the count, but there was a lot of videos, and every one, and most of them were Sonic videos, and Sonic X videos. And let me just say, fans that tuned into them, that watched them, were amazed. They really enjoyed them. And if you think, and if you think just like Thorny Hitchhog does, Desert Rose was one of my best. You ain't seen nothing yet, because there will be more to come. I mean, Thorny, let me just point this out to you. You could go out, and you could you could go on the site and go to other Sonic sites, and you can ask them about my videos, and they would t could probably give you a list of some of the best ones they've seen.